And then I saw him steal the car. The accused? Yes, him. And then I saw the sergeant and I decided to report it. Sergeant. Uh, thank you, Mrs. Wise. <clears throat> Take your time. Thank you. You're welcome. At uh, 15.58 on the 6th of last month. Oh, it's my birthday. Really? Yeah, 6th. I'm the 7th. Extraordinary. <laughs> How old were you? Not relevant to the case. Let's keep it professional, Sergeant. Thank you. And then I... Did you uh, go out with your wife? Not married. I didn't do much. Didn't get very much either. Are you serious? Yeah. Some soaps. Voucher. I don't care what you got. I came here to give evidence, not to watch you two flirt. Excuse me. We were not flirting. We weren't, were we? No. Hmm. I have taken time out of my busy schedule to come here as part of my civic duty. Yes, of course. Sorry. Uh, Sergeant. At 15.58 on the 6th of last month, I was approached in Highfield Road by Mrs Payne, who informed me she just witnessed Mr Warren uh, stealing a motor vehicle. Mr Warren, I have witnesses and CCTV. Now, I like to consider myself a forgiving and caring person. Some say a little too caring, a little too forgiving. Some even say I have a beguiling smile. For goodness sake! This man has committed a serious crime. Just do your job and put him in prison. Yes. I'm about to. Uh, you just found out I'm dead. A little bit of upset, please. The red one's nice. Not so sure about the blue. Marley! Great. Thank you. Look, I is this going to take long? Because I've got people coming over. Tell her. Yeah. His last words were, tell Katie I loved her and I'm sorry.